Good morning, stand up please. Good morning, students. Good morning. How are you? I'm great. Awesome, I like that answer. Sit down please. My name is Teacher Johnny. That is my nickname. Now, um, I'm really hungry today, but I only have 100 baht, and I have a friend. I gotta pay for two people. So, yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Yeah, I got that. So, I have 50 baht for myself. I spend, I have a, how many do I have total? Oh, I wish. I have 100 baht total. How much can I spend on my friend? What do you think? Oh, this is easy because it's an easy example. I spend X. <gasps> you never see this. Oh my God, this is algebra. It's actually not that bad. If you see something, you're not scared of it later. Okay, so 50 plus x equals what? What do you think? 100, this is how we write this. If you're big kids now, you can do. How else do we write this? If we have this fact family, yeah, you've seen this before, actually. What if I write this? You know this, right? We have four plus three is seven. We have, yeah, three plus four is seven, good. What else? Seven minus, what? Yeah, seven minus three is four. And what else? Yes, seven minus four is three. Now we have 50 plus x equals, yeah, equals 100. We have 100 equal, 100 minus what? Say it together, 100 minus, yes equals, yeah, but then we say x equals 50. So I spend 50 on myself, what do you think I get? Yeah, bacon and eggs and a burger, I'm from. What do you think my friend gets? Oh, that will be interesting, my friend gets some time. You like some time? Yeah, I like that stuff too, actually. Maybe I get some time for me, Tom Yam for them. What do you think? Yeah, I thought so. Okay, so I'm gonna erase my name. So sorry. Now, let's do more examples. Another example. Do we have our textbooks? Yeah, let me turn on the projector here. Okay, give me a minute. Mm. My computer is so old because I have no money, <laughs> but, um, oh, is it working? Yeah, okay, okay, good, good. Your system is working because you have a good school. Okay, so, this is my page. Do we all have the textbook? Very good. Professor Longton once told me, that pen and paper is good for memory. Online will never be good enough. So, page one, read it to me. Yes. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. So we can put a box or a bar around here. This is called a bar. What is a bar? 
No, 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 no. A bar is a long, thin piece of wood or metal. This is a bar too. Now, what's a model? Oh yeah? Model sells what? Yeah, sells clothes, sells... I, um, I, I walk by big C, I see a big sign, Oriental Princess, Juvederm. What do they sell? Makeup. I'm selling to you some math. This is called a bar model. And the bar model has 15,600, yes. And what's the other number here? The bigger number is, that's right. Stay together, 20, yes. Okay. Now remember from before, what do we put here? X is too much, too much X. What about this? What is this? Very good. We can put anything. We could put X, Y, Z, O on. We could put George on. Oh, I'm terrible at time. But we could put anything, a star, a heart. It's all good. Let's put Y for now. So, come up here. I need another volunteer. Come here. That's right. Come to the front. Now draw for me a fact family. Mm-hmm. Good. And we have what? Down here we have X. Actually, up here we have X. Very good. Down here, 2, 1, 4, 5, 0. Good. Now... What do we write? This one plus x equals what? That's right. Equals 21,450. Now that's going forward. What about going backward? Can we do subtraction? That's right. Come on, keep writing. Let's go. What do you think? Can we do this in our, go sit down, thank you. Can we do this in our head? I mean, maybe you can. At your age, I could probably do it. But, can we solve this way? Come up here, someone come up here. Good, how do you usually solve this? Yes. We're doing things we already know. We're doing them in a new way. And how do we, that's right. Very good. Why do you need me? Do this yourself. Okay. All right, good. Stay with me. Five. Sit down, please. Thank you. Five thousand. Eight. Five. And zero. That's right. And there you solved problem number one. What do you think? Who wants to solve problem number two together? And who wants to solve problem number two by themselves? Okay. So, um, you have 10 minutes to solve problems two, three, four, five. Can you do it? Can you do it? I think you can do it in groups. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Good. I need the ones to work together. I need the twos to work together. I need the threes. You get the idea. We have teams now. So, can team one solve problem two?
team two solve problem three. What do you think team three will do? Mm -hmm. That's right. So work together for 10 minutes. You can do it, come on. All right, good job, 10 minutes are up. Now, for problem number two, what did you say is the answer? Okay, let me check my notes. Yes, I solved it this way too. Problem number three, what did you say? Yes, good. Number five, let's shake things up. What did you say? All right, number four? Okay, good, you guys got it all right, A plus. Now, let's do a game together. I have here some um, snacks. I have cups, one cup, two cup, three cup, four cup. So, take one jar of peanuts, you come here. I need two volunteers. Can you come here? Thank you. And you, come here. I have the green peas. I have the mixed peas. Can you pour into cups one and two? Good, thank you. Can you pour into, that's right, you know what to do. Okay. So, take the cup to your team. You take the cup to your team. Actually, Two cups. Eh, you caught my mistake, okay. Now, with your cup, I'm gonna give your team three more cups, three more cups, three more cups, three more cups. So, I want you to subtract five peas for every cup. Yeah? Good, good. You're gonna work at the pharmacy. You're gonna work at the bar. It means decanting, it means separating units. It's a good skill. So, now that you've separated, let's write about it. You have your notebooks. In your notebook, can you draw me a model, a bar model, with all these pieces? How many, pe how many peas are in that cup? What do you think? That's very creative, I like. 328 sounds a little high, but why not? And we have five here, and five here, and five here. You, sir, you still have the original cup. How many is left? What do you think? Well, we call this A. I wish I could use tie letters. They're so much fun. What do you think is A in this bar model? What do you think? Okay, so what do we do first? Hmm, 328 minus A equals what? Huh, you don't know, huh? What about if I say five plus five plus five plus A equals what? Yes, very good. What is this? Yes, 15 plus A equals what? That's right, 328 and last step, 328 minus, we all writing this down? I promise you, you get to eat after the lesson. Please write it down first, okay? 328 minus what? Yes, equals, uh-huh, very good. So, you can now, you, I don't want you to eat this much, you'll be sick. Just share that cup, can you do? That's right, teamwork makes the dream work. Now you guys, how about, choose a number, pick a number, any number. Yeah, 
I like that. 13. You're going to be 13? No, you're not going to be 13. Your brother's 13? Yeah, maybe I know him. 13. What's here? Yes. And? And? Oh, we already used that. How about pick anything, like a symbol? A cat? I like it. It's hard to draw, but uh, I'm terrible at art. Sorry. I'm not teaching art. Good. So how many peas do you think you have? Yeah, your cup has more than him. Oh, lucky guy. 508. It's really not. It's more like 50, but okay. So how much is cat? Well, how do we solve? 13 plus 13 plus 13 plus cat equals, yes, 508. You get the idea. What does this equal? Mm -hmm. And then, mm -hmm. what? Okay. How about you solve this by writing it down and you guys can eat your canoe? Very good. Thank you, students. You have your homework, right? Okay, homework is here. Come collect it. Thank you, students.